Josh, you're not punching. <laughs> What's up everybody? Normally, when I film here at this spot in my studio, you kind of see me walking down the steps, opening the door, switching on the light switch. I do the same shot all the time. But uh, currently, I'm not wearing pants. So we'll keep it from the waist up. All right, you know what time it is. All right, so it's been a while since I've done a, a q and A. Got a couple questions that came in today. So let's get right into it. I'm gonna try to keep these Friday Q and A's a little more short and to the point. First question comes from my dad on Facebook. Are you going to the movie premiere? I will not be going to the movie premiere. What he is referencing, referencing, referring, 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 referring. What he's talking about is the buzz going in our town right now that a major Hollywood motion picture is being filmed in our hometown with Mr. Echo, Shooter McGavin, and Heather Graham. How I'm involved in that is, I guess, location scouts went into Big Wave Burritos. Uh, Heather Graham's character owns a surf shop and they took 20 surfboards off the roof of Big Wave Burritos to act as props in the surf shop. And at the same time, they took all my artwork from Big Wave. So all my artwork will be in the background um, in the surf shop scene from this new movie that will probably go direct to DVD. And I made 150 bucks from letting them hang my artwork up for zero work. Next question, Britt Cameron. Is the tree still there? I don't know why I'm speaking right at you, Britt. Why are you so bent on me cutting down, getting rid of this tree that brings children so much joy? This tree is amazing. This tree fell over, kind of on the trampoline, and the kids love climbing on it and jumping off of on it. Yeah, it's dangerous. Someone's probably gonna break an arm or get stitches. So no, tree hasn't been cut down yet. Truth of the matter is, I'm just I'm lazy. Dave Biondi asks, do you still play the drums? What Dave is referencing is when I did play the drums back in the 90s, an alt rock cover band, the Grommets. If you remember the Grommets, leave me a little thumbs up below in the comments. The Grommets were my, my band in high school and I played the drums. And yes, I still do play the drums. I fill in on the drums at my church, Revolve Church in North Cape May. Uh, I do play the drums, I fill in. There are three other drummers that are much better than me. So when those three are unavailable, you get me. Whoa, 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 whoa. What do we got here? Sherry's berries I got for Mother's Day, but I'm willing to share. This one right here is a good one. Oh my gosh, that's so good. Happy Mother's Day to me. <laughs> to me. This mother right here, the lighting's really bad, has, works full time, has two kids at home all the time, four kids at home sometimes, because two of the kids go to school for like a couple hours, does the laundry, does cooks meals. This is a good mom right here. Don't ask if I brush my teeth today, because I don't think I did. Anyway, this painting right here, painted it last week, and it just sold today. I'm pretty excited about that. So it's gotta get framed, and it's going to be delivered next week. Pretty excited about that. Been working on a lot of new paintings lately. I thought I had another question here. Here we go. This is a video question. Hi, David, it's Jeanette. And Lily. And we have some questions for you. I want to know what other kinds of stuff do you paint other than ocean themed pieces? And I want to know what you like to do for fun in the snow. Thanks. Thank you guys for your questions. I love video questions. If you're going to ask questions, message me in a video. Send them on Snapchat or send me a message on Facebook because I love video questions. They're more fun because I get to see the people who are asking the questions. Um, this is actually an old question that kind of got lost in my messages. So what do I like to do fun in the snow? I've been skiing like four times. I've never been snowboarding. I like it when the bay freezes and you can like walk out 
on the big chunks of ice. I like that as well. So hopefully no more snow this year. And then Jeanette asks, what things do I paint other than sea life and marine themes? That's mainly what I do. Um, octopus, whales, waves, fish. It's what I do a lot of. But I do have this painting here. Well, it's a picture of a painting. The actual painting's upstairs. But I have this pinned to my wall. So this is a picture. This is a picture I painted of my son when he was still a foster uh, kid and it has his case number. And for me, it was uh, kind of a piece I needed to get out where I was very frustrated of this idea of when we would go to court, he was referenced as, they would use his name, but it wasn't very personable. And, and, and lawyers and judges and people would, would reference him just as like a case. And for me, it was an actual child that I love. All right, now lastly, we're gonna close with this. This went a little longer. I got kind of winded tonight, I apologize. What I wanna do here is, uh, everyone who filled out the survey that I posted this week, thank you so much. That was so very helpful to have really great insight into what people are thinking, what they like. I wanna uh, build this web store to be a resource. Get some better lighting over here. I wanna build this web store to be uh, the website, the web store to be a resource for people who are looking for presents, looking for unique gifts, looking for decorations for their home. But I wanna know what you like, what you need, um, and what you're into. So the surveys were so helpful. I had uh, 88 people respond to the surveys, which gives me a very good indication of what people are thinking. I have an app here that randomly selects so you know I'm being fair here. All right, so the way this works, giveaway winner, select entry survey, how many winners won. So pick a winner and this generates, the winner is Jim Vincent Jr. Your winner survey. So Jim Vincent, you are the winner. I will shoot you an email. Thanks everybody for your feedback. Have a good weekend. See you on Tuesday.